number i was lightning before the thunder thunder hello children welcome to else math tutor channel in this video i am going to teach about parts of abacus because before going to do the problem in abacus we have to learn the parts okay shall we start first part after part it is boundary this is called a frame and this frame divided into two parts upper part and lower part see upper part and lower part divided by the horizontal line this is called a beam sometimes we can use answering ball and you can see vertical lines these are called a rods and each rod has one upper bead and four lower beads you will notice every third rod marked with a dot this is called a uni dot whenever we are doing the problem we should start from here because this is one's place this is tens place this is hundreds and so on you can start from here or here be here that is your wish now i am going to tell about value and name of the beads first upper bead is also called a heaven bead each has a value of 5 now lower bead is this is called the earth bead each value of 1 see Abacus is not only skill here most important speed and accuracy yes you should increase your speed so that you should follow certain rules now I will share one most important rules that is how to move the beads with the help of fingers first we with the help of left hand we have to hold the skill like this and the right hand hold the pencil like this and these two fingers only i'm going to use for moving the beads first lower bead whenever we are adding the beads we should use thumb finger for subtraction use index finger both adding and subtraction for upper bead use index finger okay so hope you all learn the parts now shall we do an example okay so first add five See, addition means we have to move down because whenever uh, the beads touching the answering bar or beam, it has a value. Okay. Now add two. See, I'm using thumb finger now. Okay. Add one. Now the answer is what? Five, six, seven, eight. Yes, eight. So in this video, whatever we thought I given in the picture. That in the next video. I will tell about how to do the problem in Abacus. Okay. Thank you.